Copan Diagnostics is proud to present WASP, Walkaway Specimen Processor Instrument. This revolutionary instrument offers microbiology true flexibility and the opportunity to maximize valuable resources in microbiology. The WASP instrument is the first automated specimen processor able to process all microbiology specimens in liquid format. It can process all urine specimens, stool specimens, swab specimens like throats, wounds, nares or genital swabs, fluid, tissues, and sputa. The WASP instrument affords the microbiology laboratory to reallocate valuable staff resources in areas where their expertise is essential in optimizing patient care. The following video presentation of the instrument will show you the true flexibility and value the WASP instrument will offer your laboratory. As you can see, the instrument is 90% enclosed in a clear plexiglass cover. The cover has small doors for easy access to the internal components of the instrument. The plexiglass cover, along with the HEPA filter system, ensures a clean processing environment. The workstation is located on the front of the instrument. The operator spends most of the time in this area when working with the instrument. The WASP instrument uses a touch screen command system. It has a Windows driven software and does not require a keyboard. In designing the instrument, the goal was to streamline workflow and maximize the use of space. The WASP has a built-in camera that captures a photo image of the inoculating loop every time the loop is withdrawn from the specimen container prior to being processed. The image analysis monitor looks for a droplet in the loop. If a droplet is detected, the instrument understands that the loop has reliably collected a sample and the specimen is then processed. The operator is not required to stay by the image analysis monitor. The WASP has a media carousel with nine silos. Each silo holds 36 to 42 100 mm standard plates for a capacity of 342 to 378 plates at one time. The WASP can process any media manufacturer's plates. The operator dictates the media to be loaded depending on the specimens to be run and the protocol linked to the specimen type. The specimen processing station is the area where the operator loads and unloads specimens as well as the prepared plated media. The WASP instrument is designed to process all types of containers. It can process different size urine containers including copan urey swab and different sample tubes. It can process all swab samples using copan e swab. It can process stool samples transported in Cary Blair liquid medium in plastic screw cap containers, or Copan fecal swab. The WASP can process sterile body fluids and sputum samples received in plastic screw cap containers. The WASP instrument can decap different cap sizes or pull the cap off in the situations when rubber tube stoppers are used as caps. When processing urine cup containers, you need to place the Teflon specimen cradle and guide rails onto the feeder conveyor belt and the specimen exit aisle respectively. Once the urine specimens have been processed, the Teflon specimen cradle and guide rails forward the specimens along the exit aisle and then into the specimen holding bin. When processing specimens that have not been collected in a large screw cap container, you must load the specimens using Teflon pallets. The pallets hold 6 to 12 specimens depending on the specimen container being processed. When the conveyor is fully loaded, it holds a total of 30 tissue or stool samples, or 72 specimens in Copan e swab, Copan urey swab, Copan fecal swab, or BD vacutainer in 9 Teflon pallets. Once the entire pallet of specimens has been processed, the Teflon pallet is forwarded to the specimen exit aisle. Once the exit aisle is full of completed pallets, a sensor prompts the operator to return to the instrument and unload the processed pallets. The WASP instrument has two main components. They are two SCARA robots. We have named them Tarzan and Jane. This is Tarzan. He has two arms. Tarzan's right arm is responsible for moving the specimen from the conveyor belt or the Teflon pallet to various stations within the instrument for processing and then returning the specimen back to the conveyor belt or pallet. 
Tarzan's left arm is responsible for collecting each inoculated and streaked plate from the plate streaking station after Jane has completed her tasks. Tarzan presents each plate to the labeler where a label is applied to the bottom of each plate, then plates are stacked on the media stacker. This is Jane. Her functions are to sterilize the loops, to dip the loop in the specimen to collect a sample, if a droplet is detected in the loop, to seed the plate and then streak it according to the predetermined streak pattern. The wasp uses a standard bacteriology incinerator. Jane uses this incinerator to sterilize the triquetra loop. Clean air is continually circulated during the operation of the instrument. The triquetra loop comprises of three loops held by a central plastic wheel. The three loops are identical and this unique arrangement is designed to maximize the throughput of specimens so there is no delay between sterilization cycles. The triquetra loop device is available with four loop sizes, 1 microliter loop, 10 microliter loop, 30 microliter loop, and 50 microliter loop. This labeler can manage any size label as well as transparent or opaque labels. The amount of information included on the label is determined by the information the operator would like to download from the LIS system and have included on the plate label. The plate label is applied to the bottom of the petri dish. After each plate is streaked and labeled, Tarzan sweeps the plate over the barcode reader as a check to ensure there is a label on the inoculated media before it is stacked. After the instrument stacks the inoculated and streaked plates in quantities of 12 on the media stacker, each stack of 12 will be fed down this inoculated media exit conveyor belt. Once the inoculated media exit conveyor belt is full, there are sensors at the base of the conveyor belt that prompt the operator to remove the plates and place the plates directly into an incubator rack for incubation. The WASP provides a new and revolutionary system to automatically plant and streak all microbiology samples, swabs, urines, and feces. The WASP eliminates the tedious and laborious job of specimen accessioning, open, sample, close, multiple times each day. It frees up staff to do more valuable tasks. The WASP is a much needed solution at a time of increasing workload and diminishing staff resources. It eliminates fatigue and repetitive stress injuries. The WASP provides standardized, reliable, and reproducible planting and streaking. No sick days, holidays, bad hair days, or coffee breaks. It even works the night shift. If you are interested in an in-depth video demonstration that includes all the features of the WASP instrument, please call area code 951-696-6957 or email info at copanusa.com 